All right, welcome back to the Swing Clinic. We're here at Geneva National. How about this golf course? We're on a 17th hole of the Palmer Golf Course here at Geneva National Resort. And this is a pretty cool shot right here. It really is breathtaking. It's so scenic. You got the lake. You can't ask for more in a golf course. Yeah. But one thing that you cannot do on number 17, whether it's with the driver, a seven iron, or even a putter probably, you can't hit it left here on 17, can you? You will be in the water. Yeah, you'll be in the water and your hole will be over. So I'm going to show you a drill. Number one, to stop you from hitting it left. But then besides that, it's also going to help you be able to hit your iron shots crisper. Johnny Miller huge fan. I watch Johnny Miller videos until I fall asleep at night. I think the guy knows the golf swing and knows the game as good as anybody, right? Johnny Miller, Nick Faldo, Greg Norman, three guys that I just I just love to watch and listen. I know they're all a little older than you. You probably don't even remember most of them, do you? I just watch you, Jimmy. Oh, okay. That's a good answer. So uh, Johnny <laughs> Miller uh, has done a video many, many times on what to do with the left shoulder in the golf swing. So I'm going to pass it on to you. All right. Thanks to Johnny. Set up to it. So left shoulder is so, so important in the golf swing. Many of you feel like you need to stay behind the golf ball or help the golf ball up. So take it to the top, Caroline. So when you do that and you stay back on your right side and go ahead down, but stay back on your right side, your left shoulder stays back here, right? So it never gets in a position for you to be able to hit down on the golf ball. Or what will happen is you stay there, club face goes left because you're hanging back, right? And that ball's going in the water right there. Right? And it's just, it, it looks bad too. Yeah. I and mean, it just looks silly. Not a good position. No. So go ahead and set up to it. What we want is, we want a little forward lean out of this left shoulder in the downswing. So Caroline's going to take it to the top. Then she's going to start her downswing. And her, there you go. She's going to let that left shoulder get up at least to the golf ball in front of the golf ball. Two things are going to happen. You're not going to hit it left if you get up here. And you're also going to get in a position, just like Caroline is, to hit the golf ball first and hit the ground afterwards. Just a little bit of lean. Take it back again. Normal golf swing. Lean into my left. That a girl right there. You get into that position. Ball will not go left. You'll hit the ball first. You'll strike it better. Show them how it's done, Caroline. Left shoulder lean from the top. Key to being a good ball striker. Good, 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 good. As you can see, Caroline was able to get to the ball first. That ball didn't even try to go left mm -mm. right there. No, it felt good. So water on the left, okay, or any type of time when you're tr struggling hitting the golf ball first, left shoulder. It should key. happen naturally. Yeah. Oh, FYI, if you're right-handed, you got to flip that all around if you're like our camera guy, Brian Franny, and you hit from the wrong side of the ball. But if you hit from the correct side of the ball, just kidding. Left shoulder. Left shoulder. <laughs> flip it around if you're lefty. All right. All right. We come back. More swing clinic here from one of the